Hello, my name is Victoria Rose. Welcome to my channel. I am in Seoul, South Korea right now. And today we are gonna go cafe hopping. Now, last night I had my first vegan authentic Korean meal with a friend, content creator that I met here. Oh, you put it in the Oh. See, this is why I'm afraid to go in restaurants by myself. <laughs> what if you just walked in? <laughs> I know, I would do that too. Yeah. Just put mine in there. Thank you. This is so cool. This is so cool. We have a lot of stuff. Yeah. Maybe it's not like there's no Korean here. There's all foreigners here. So I'm at this vegan restaurant in Korea. So I can eat everything off this menu, which is strange. So I think I'm going to get the vegan chicken. And look at us. We're sat on the floor. I don't know if this is getting you in the shot. Does it look about right? This is Jimmy. He, um, he also does uh, content creation. And we're going to get some vegan Korean food. I'm pretty sure I'm going to get the sweet and spicy chicken. Okay. Look at that. That's good. A little ASMR. <laughs> Does it taste like chicken? You don't like it? Mm, it's not like chicken, but I, I, I like it. I approve. It's okay. I'm gonna meet up with a follower that I haven't met yet and we're gonna go cafe hopping and find some interesting cafes here because they have a lot of different ones. Okay, so we're here at the first cafe. It's like an acorn cafe. Look, it looks like um, kind of like a little haunted house type of, it's based on this character, this blue one, and it's doturi. I don't know how to say it the Korean way, but it's a newer cafe and we're gonna go inside and see what it looks like. <laughs> How do you do this? Do you like pour it in? Oh, it, yeah, it goes like Oh, that. whoops. <laughs> I know, it's so interesting, right? Interesting. cafe was really really good and really cute so we're heading to the next one it's kind of like a it's called tape cafe and they have like galaxy cakes so this one I'm the most I'm really excited about because you'll see why I'm gonna do a voiceover for some of this because my microphone died and a lot of the audio is a bit obnoxious. So we're gonna do a voiceover. This is the galaxy cake and this is uh, some sort of coffee. I don't remember what it was. I think it was some sort of German coffee. And this is a strawberry cheesecake, actually. And it was around, like, I'd say five or so dollars. Um, it was very tasty. It was small. They had other types of cakes too, but yeah, it was, they specialized in galaxy cakes. The coffee was extraordinary. So we came to this nearby Shiba Cafe, which is like Shiba Dogs, um, but they're closed for some reason. 
So we're going to try to find a different cafe, maybe a cat cafe, um, and then we're going to take some take some traditional tea. We're going to have some <laughs> traditional tea. This is Myeongdong, and it's one of my favorite places in Seoul, actually, just because of these streets. We found the cat cafe, and you have to take your shoes off. Yeah. And it's, it was around, I want to say, it was less than $10 to get in. And they give you a free drink as well. I got a peach tea. <laughs> the cats seemed really well taken care of, and they had water and food and litter boxes, and they could leave or hide anytime they wanted to from people. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, it's really sweet. <laughs> I love this cat because its legs were so short. I've been to a cat cafe in, in Tokyo as well. The cats there seemed a lot grumpier than the ones here, but you never know with cats. These are actually zodiac fortune things that you can do. And now we're making our way to the tea house and this is whenever my SD card got full so I wasn't able to capture too much of it, but it was really beautiful. I got this really good berry tea. And then we also got this pumpkin kind of like semi-sweet rice bread or something but it tasted like cornbread it was very satisfying just the texture and the taste and that was my day out and this is just random footage of me trying to open a coconut that i got at the store okay let's try this thing To the dollar something. This is like spongy on the top. I mean, it looks like a very, 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 very baby coconut. Did you just stick it in? <laughs> the fuck? This can't be right. <laughs> really? <laughs> no wonder it's on sale. It's breaking. I gave up trying to open it and I put it in the fridge and like a week later I got really hungry so I cracked it open on my bathroom floor and just let me tell you it was the sweetest most tastiest coconut I've ever had it was a baby one and I drank all of its liquids and ate the inside and it was really really good I think the hole wasn't punctured well enough at the top or I didn't have the facilities to open it but it was delicious <laughs> and lastly before I go here and we leave our cafe adventures. I wanted to show you the nightlife in Seoul because it's a huge part of why people go there. I It's not a thing for me, but I wanted to show you quickly because I was... <laughs> Saturday and it's insanely busy. There's people everywhere. Um, they party a lot here, I guess. I don't normally do nightlife, but I want to show you guys what it's like here in the nighttime. This is what it's like. So I'm going to photo shoots with a photographer here, and uh, otherwise I wouldn't come out. There's way too many people for me. So that is the conclusion of this video. Thank you so much for coming with me. Stay tuned for the next video. 
stay extraterrestrial. Okay, bye.